And what Nagar did, what Nagar did was possess the son so terribly through turmoil, writhing in pain and anger. And in that process awoken other beings, other entities. You can imagine the nebulas turning like a soup in a bowl, all these different ingredients all swirling. And at one point, something else emerged from the creation of Nagar's artificial reality and the construct that had been forged from the time of the schism. Amon became a creature, became something else, became so distant from its original state of being that on Earth, people started to call this the Dark Sun. Had other names as well. The name that is remembered the most is Kronos. This sun became an old, decrepit, possessed, you could say fallen, character. You see, all suns and planets and moons are living beings. They all have energy. They all belong to the center of the source, the creation of all that is. But when they are taken or when they are possessed, they become something else. And that's what happened to Amon.